What is going on guys and girls? My name is James and welcome back today to Roblox. How are we doing everyone? Welcome back, welcome back. Today of course it is time once again to jump back into Beast Swarm Simulator and today we have potentially one of the coolest things that I've ever seen in Beast Swarm. Yes, a new leak has dropped. It is such a cool one. A brand new cub buddy but with a difference. Today we're going to talk about it. I'm going to talk about a few other things. It's going to be a good time. Beast Swarm positivity is back on the menu boys. And everyone's invited for dinner. Have you got your knife and fork? Let's go. And in three, and in two, and in one. Claim the hive. Yeah, welcome back, everybody. Hopefully, you are all doing amazing. Of course, over the past week or so, we have finally been getting some concrete information, some actual physical images to do with the next Bee Swarm update. Now, of course, at this moment in time, people are still speculating, is it actually going to be called Beesmus or not? I still think, personally, yes, it will be called Beesmus. It is going to be a festive event. I know summer is coming for a lot of people, but remember... In other countries, it's not summer. So technically, it still works. <laughs> but I think it's going to be called Beesmus. And yeah, we've got this amazing new cub buddy to take a look at today. It's going to be good times. Shall we head over to Mr. Fungus? I think we should. Mr. Fungus. There we go. Home sweet home. Um, so yeah, just once again, thank you so much for coming and hanging out. Um, thank you for the bee swarm positivity, keeping the hype up. Um, of course, when we have new things to look at, that always is really, really helpful. Um, so if we could please try and get 2,000 likes in this episode, that'd be really cool just thank you for your continued support especially with Beast Swarm and how long things are taking with updates and stuff it's always really good to keep you know some excitement and stuff going so yeah just thank you for being here and uh, yeah cool should we start I think we should righty yo here we go um so yeah just the one like brand new leak to look at today but it does tie into some stuff that we previously saw in the last episode so it's kind of like on theme which makes sense oh yeah by the way super quickly um I just started like a new little um sort of mini series on the channel um it's on a game called my bee tycoon uh, and my kind of plan just in general i know you know if we've got like a bee update and stuff going that's going to be the focus but sort of just in general like this year I'd like to just play like a few other random games, just some stuff for fun, really, nothing crazy. I do really like tycoons and stuff like that. This is a brilliant tycoon. Um, it's only one episode up, which was yesterday, but if you haven't seen it already, please do go and check it out. There'll be like two or three episodes, maybe four. Uh, it's a fantastic tycoon. It's like an old school tycoon, but like super modern with like other stuff as well. It is based around bees, uh, but the modeling's amazing, super fun, super chill. And yeah, it'd be great for you to you know, see you over there and hang out. Anyway, right, so late last night, um, I think it was late last night, uh, On it basically uploaded like a ton of the most random images into his, um, into his uh, inventory. Let me just pop them up for myself. <laughs> and as you can see, they sort of don't make too much sense when you look at them one by one. But this is kind of like the genius of Roblox and the, sort of just how good On it is at doing things. Um, you see all of these random images, and there's a bit of a clue there, as you can see in the bottom right-hand side corner. Uh, but you've got all these, like, random patchwork images. So these must have all, like, had to have been made one by one. And when you look at them like this, they don't look like too much sense, do they? Apart from the bottom one. Uh, and you think, well, what is he cooking? What is on it cooking? Well... You cut them and put them all together, you add a bit of spice, and then all of a sudden, ta-da! <laughs> you have a brand new doodle cub. Oh my goodness, this is like the coolest thing. So, you know, look at it. I mean, for starters, it looks visually absolutely amazing. I absolutely love this one. Um, and yeah, this is the brand new cub buddy, which is going to be part of the next update. So already we can start sort of speculating how on earth we are going to be able to get this bad boy. Um, and you've got to remember as well, we've already had some new cub buddies in the sticker update. So we have the um, the, the Astro Cub, the Space Cub. Uh, what's it actually called? The Space Cub? I can't remember. Star Cub! <laughs> it's called the Star Cub. So we had the Star Cub and we had the Sticky Boy Junior, like, you know, the little stick bug cub. Um, but this one is, I guess, sort of the, the more beesmus one. I guess it's not really festive looking, but it is really really cool and of course you've got to remember in the previous businesses we always had a cub as sort of part of a reward more or less so last year we had the two versions of the robo cub and then we had the little weird snowman looking one we had the gingerbread cub um so perhaps this is going to be the exclusive one for beesmus the thing is though you've got to remember in the last episode too we did see the brand new leaks for the new hives and of course in case you missed them i'll, I'll pop them up again uh, but we do have a doodle hive as well so just looking at like both of these things i, I definitely think these are going to be super rare to get um of course now with the sticker dynamic we do have different means of actually getting some rare items i tell you what we'll do actually should we should we go and do a, a cheeky little sticker roll let's see what we can get don't know what kind of eggs we've got but let's just go with uh have we got yeah there we go <laughs> all right <laughs> so let's go with the gifted mythic egg three two one 
Come on, let's go. Let's go. Give me something good. Give me something good. Don't give me a dupe. Don't give me a dupe. It's... I think it's a dupe. Oh, it's a Leo star sign. Hey, I'm a Leo. <laughs> okay, cool. I haven't got that one. Yeah, just to continue, of course, we do have some, like, new means and methods of, of how to obtain, you know, these kind of things. Uh, but I'm kind of curious because normally what happens, right, is when you have, um, you know, Bee Bear and he comes and stands literally, like, right here. Uh, and he's got, like, his bee on, the, on, on his shoulder and then he's got, like, a present. And then normally there's a cub buddy that stands on the present box. So is this doodle cub going to be the exclusive cub buddy or is it going to be much harder to get? I don't know, really. But to be honest with you, uh, the dilemma is very difficult for me personally because I'm very, very loyal to Jupes. And I don't know if anyone else out there is very loyal to their cup buddy, but Jupes has been around since day one-ish when he first came into the game. Um, and he stood by me for a very, very long time. Of course, Jupes back in the day was when you like manually had to stand here and then just like do royal jellies <laughs> over and over and over to try and get like gifted bees. And uh, I used to get an awful lot of duplicate bees, which is why he's called Jupes. It was way back in the folklore of Bee Swarm Simulator. And this is why this guy is called Jupes. So I couldn't possibly replace him. But at the same time, I think out of all the cup buddies that I've ever seen, the doodle one is definitely my favorite. Yeah, what do you guys think just in general about, you know, other stuff that's coming out for the Beesmas update? Of course, um, it's it's not going to be anything like crazy groundbreaking, I don't think. We're not going to have like a brand new mini game. I doubt we're going to have any new zones, anything like that. But I, I guess in terms of how important the sticker update is to the game, it's all about, um, you know, continuing on with the way that custom hives are a thing. Obviously, that's a part of the sticker update that I think people do forget is that you can now customize your hive, uh, which is a really, really cool option. And then, of course, we're getting the wavy hives. I wouldn't be surprised as well maybe if there's like another customized shape for a hive i think just having two of them wouldn't make too much sense you might as well if you're going to do two you might as well do three or four so maybe on it's cooking something like that we don't know that for certain just yet that's just speculation um but yeah i think we will be getting just some more cosmetic type items so skins for cub buddies i think is important because we can trade those as well and i do also think we're going to be getting some more stickers um in the previous episode we did like show a couple of the new stickers which were all festive themed we had um the uh, festive bee sticker and we also had the bbm um sticker as well so these are obviously tying into a beesmas type thing but i do think in general we're probably going to get some more stickers i think it would make sense maybe some ones that you can only exclusively get in beesmas who knows man i'm excited just to see some new stuff i really hope you guys are excited too i know this is only like one thing in this episode but i think it's a cool one i think it's worth talking about honor is cooking let the man cook and as soon as we hear from him, it will be great. But it's good to see him cooking. It's good. It's good, man. It's good. <laughs> right. So unfortunately, that's all that I have to share with you today. So a bit of a shorter one here today. Um, but, you know, it's a really cool one, I think. Uh, it's probably my favorite thing that I've seen so far. But I guess that's the beauty of it. Like, nothing happens for a while. And then all of a sudden, things can, like, develop momentum quite quickly. Um, so, yeah, it's probably going to be a big month, I think, for, for, for leaks and for new stuff. And uh, I will be here every step of the way to show you as soon as I can see. So, yeah. Anyway, until next time. Thanks. And see you. Yeah.